हेलो एंड नमस्ते एवरीवन माय नेम इज सारा एंड वेलकम टू माय चैनल आई हैव बीन अवे फॉर अ लॉन्ग टाइम एंड आई बीन यू नो सिक लेटली सो आई एम इन द हॉस्पिटल राइट नाउ एज यू कैन टेल आई एम ऑलवेज इन द हॉस्पिटल बट दिस टाइम आई एम इन द हॉस्पिटल एज अ पेशेंट सो आई वांट टू जस्ट मेक अ वीडियो एंड शेयर विद यू गाइस व्हाट हैपेंड टू मी so if you are new here obviously welcome i hope you stick around and if you are my regular family welcome back i know it's been long time um i wanna like just make this video and take you guys in a journey of me in the hospital for the first time in my life so what happened to me okay um first of all i want to say thank you if you are coming from tiktok and watching this video i don't know how to thank you guys you have no idea how many of you guys were messaging me on instagram just wishing me you know to feel well i i appreciate you all so much you guys have no idea some of you even came to meet me in the hospital that is such a big deal for me i really appreciate all of you um so let's jump into the condition mala je ek to me dekh pet to dekh the like i had this stomach pain going on for a while i've been ignoring it and um at that point when i had a pain on my side like right side ko stomach mein ek dum mere pain lag raha tha i was crying if you know me from tiktok you can watch my video i've uploaded there like this crying then i came to ed they did few scans they saw nothing they sent me home with heavy like very strong pain relief then i had that pain relief i was on the bed for like literally whole day and the next day i had to come back to ed again because i was not feeling i was not feeling it i was not okay my body was kept telling me something is wrong go go to the hospital like go then i came to ed again mind you i was in the chair in the ed for like 9 hours like literally waiting for the bed anyway finally got to bed in the morning so i arrived around 11 o'clock at night and morning time ma i think 9 o'clock or 9:30 they finally got to bed for me so i was transferred to the ward then after that they had to do a scope on me scope means like a gastroscopy they had to put a camera inside my mouth obviously i was down and they checked my stomach like what's going on there whatever and they seems to find nothing like there was nothing wrong with me but i still have the pain the pain is there like you know and i was keep telling my doctors like i am not going home feeling like this i am about to go nepal for my wedding i do not want to leave the hospital and come back again the next day like do something please oh this is a better lighting here so anyway then um i forced them to do something about it so they did book me in for this um scan called hydro scan i don't know if i'm pronouncing it right but i did went for this scan and i was there for like 2 hours they had to do this scan for 2 hours so um in that scan when i was there for 2 hours 1 hour they did this scan on my empty stomach and the next hour i had to drink one drink and they had to do the scan and that's when they found out that my gall bladder was i not working like it was not doing the job it was supposed to be do so gall bladder is a very small organ live next to our liver and it function is to break down fat into fatty acid so our body can digest it and my gall bladder was not doing that so that's why um every time i eat something a little bit fatty i used to have a pain in my stomach yeah it makes sense now but anyway like you know i was ignoring the pain as everyone do um it was not that bad until i had this really bad pain but anyway that's that's the whole case that's what what happened so if you're having a stomach pain please see your doctor don't ignore it like please just go and do scan 
Okay guys, update. I took a nap because I was in so much pain and I don't wanna keep taking painkillers so I really like slept and it is like currently nearly five o'clock. The nurses came and told me that I can eat now because my surgery has been canceled for today which is a good and a bad news. Good because I can eat bad because I'm gonna be in pain for one more night. Hopefully tomorrow they will do my surgery. <coughs> so one of my friends from TikTok, like someone who followed me on TikTok, I'm not gonna disclose the name, came to visit me today. And she got me this, how cute. I'm, I'm drinking this now, it's very nice and very healthy because she knows um i eat healthy food <laughs> hi guys it's friday it's around 6 30. um my food is here i'm still um nail by mouth since morning i'm having some fluids running some fluids is running um just call the doctor and they said to keep me nil by mouth still I might go for surgery tonight I'm not too sure so I really hope I'm going because the pain is really bad the nurse gave me a hot pack it was so nice helping a little but yeah I'll update you hi guys I just woke up almost seven o'clock in the morning um ignore my crazy hair i'm trying to play like i'm gonna braid on the two sides but um the theater just called and said that i'm going in for a surgery i'm so happy i'm in so much pain i just had some endo and panadol but i'm happy that it's happening finally I will update you guys probably after my surgery now, okay? Good luck to me. So she's just recovering right now. Bob, are you okay? Feel better? It's okay, you're gonna get better, okay? So I can take you home. How are you? Love you. Yeah, 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 yeah. Moby, good. Have a mouth. Good girl. Hold it yourself. Good girl. Hi guys, um, update. So today is Sunday, it's 7 o'clock in the morning. My like day one surgery, I had surgery yesterday. They removed my gallbladder. I haven't slept over the night. I've been crying. I was in so much pain. It hurts to talk. It hurts to cough. It hurts to pee. Um, yeah, I just want to update that um, I'm still in the hospital. Hopefully, I will go home very soon. So 
day one of full post surgery. Um, she is feeling better than yesterday. Aren't you? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, a little I bit can, better. I can so that, this is maybe second proper meal. So she will be obviously eating more vegetables, more fruits. A very small portion, maybe I think more of a soft food because she has moved her gallbladder and yeah and so thankful ah. it's cramping yeah so but you need to eat okay just take your time eat slowly but try to eat those foods okay especially the vegetables because you've been throwing them small portion just make sure you chew So I've got one, two, three, four. Just got home, about to have a shower now. I can't wait. Uh, this is a waterproof dressing, so even if I have shower, this is not gonna be wet. Oh my God, I can't even bed. Hi guys, it's Monday. Um, I got home yesterday afternoon. It was very hard because I was so used to sleeping in the hospital bed. The whole incline got it up. God, I said this to boy, no. Uh, it was very hard to sleep. The surgical side was hurting so bad. Um, I just want to say thank you so much for watching this video. I will upload another video on my recovery, how I'm recovering. But this is the part one of my surgery video, so make sure you like this video and share. Um, spread the you know awareness of if you have a sick tummy if you feel like something is wrong just go and check up i can't even talk the world i didn't any to lose husband if you decide now anyway i'll see you guys on my next video bye i love you all